My name is Tom Price. I'm from Bowling Green, Ohio. I own an LVT4, which is a landing vehicle track model 4, also known as amphibious tractor or Amtrak for short. This is a vehicle that has built on tracks. It's similar looking to a tank, however, it does not have the armor or guns on it. It'll have a machine gun. They were developed for use in the Pacific during World War II because most of the islands had a reef around them where the boats could not get to the shore. The Amtrak would leave the ship, cross the reef, and go on into the shore. Once it dropped off its troops, it would return back to the reef where they would meet the Higgins boats, transfer troops off the Higgins boats onto the LVTs and take them back into shore. Once all the troops were landed, then the LVTs were used to bring in ammunition, food, whatever is needed, and they would also evacuate the wounded back out to the hospital ships or the LSTs for their treatment. I acquired mine back in 1991 and restored it in 1997. I was contacted by the movie people to do the movie Flags of Our Fathers in Iceland in 2005. With the Amtraks, when you load them, you load them on backwards, and the procedure for doing it is to come across the ramp at a 45 degree angle and you throw two lines back into the ship. The lines are crossed and crew members grab the lines and pull, virtually pull by hand, the Amtrak around and line it up to the ramp. Once they get to the ramp and are lined up, you'll have a man on the front of the Amtrak standing on the hull and directing the driver. He'll give the driver the the hand signal to go in reverse, the back end of the Amtrak goes on to the LST first. The LVT-4 Alligator. Manufacturer, Food Machinery Corporation. Power plant, one continental 250 horsepower radial gasoline engine. Maximum speed, 25 miles per hour on land, 7 miles per hour on water. Carrying capacity. Six crew and 30 troops. Armor, 0.5 inches. Armament, 2.50 caliber and 2.30 caliber machine guns. Range, 300 miles on road, 75 miles on water.